it's Melissa. Happy Wednesday. I hope you're having a great morning. Um, I just wanted to pop in today to answer um, probably one of the biggest questions about SVGs um, and cutting them in Silhouette Studio. I apologize for this weird background. We're in my office, but I'm going to flip you around in a minute here so you can see my computer. So this is really the only way I can set this up. So um, I get questions all the time about I have business edition, I have designer edition, I have designer edition plus, and I can bring my Silhouette Studio, or excuse me, I can bring SVGs into Silhouette Studio, but they're not cutting. It's um, my, my cameo is saying, or my portrait is saying, job complete. So um, most of the time, it's a simple two-click uh, fix, and it's just because the way that um, Silhouette Studio imports SVGs, they import with the S with the cut lines off. They have cut lines, they just are off. So let's flip you around so you can see what I mean. Ta-da! Isn't that fancy? Yes. Okay, so here is a design. This is an SVG. Already has, um, it's all set up, does not need to be traced or anything. But if I try to cut this, um, it's going to say job complete and not because my cameo is not connected. <laughs> um, the reasoning is because you can see over here um, that it has no cut lines. The cut lines are not on. So all you have to do with the design selected is click cut, ta-da, and there you go. And you're all set to cut, okay? So just remember if your SVGs are not um, cutting, it's because they have cut lines but they are um, off by default in Silhouette Studio, so you just need to turn them back on. I should also point out to you that when you have designs um, and you're trying to import them, I have a couple SVGs here that you can see. If you have, um, if you have SVGs that you wanna bring into Silhouette Studio, I've been getting a lot of questions about it, it, they're not coming in. Well, the problem is that people go like this. They've unzipped the file and then they go to their library. Oh, don't look at some of that, that was a surprise. Um, okay, so um, they're trying to import their SVG and going like this, selecting this whole file and trying to pull it into their library and it won't work. You need to only select the actual files themselves. So you can select the PNG and the SVG and the DXF all at the same time and drag them in. But what you cannot do is select the folder itself. See how it's gonna go from 17 to 20 right here. Okay, all right, and you can even bring, if you want the SVG from this one and the SVG from this one, you can drag them in. What you don't wanna do is select the actual folder, okay? That is where you're going to get the error, okay? All right, so. Easy, right? All you have to do, turn on those cut lines from the send panel and you're good to go. That design I saw a couple of you asking is from Sofancy. I'll throw the link up for you. It's from the Farmhouse Bundle, which is ending uh, Friday. So hurry up and grab that if you want it. All right. All right, guys, have a fabulous day. I will see you on Friday.